Okay, hey guys, Mountain Boys here, and today I'm going to do an Airsoft review. I haven't really done any of these. I'm just doing this on my iPhone because I don't really have a camera. Because I'm in Atlanta right now, as you can see, it's not my room. I usually don't have big fluffy teddy bears and cloud sheets, but those things are the most comfortable things in the world, of course. And creepy stuffed animals watching me while I sleep but anyway so this is the Echo 1 as you can see and it is the Troy so before I actually get into the gun I also got some cool things that's just a hop up sticker that was on it but I got nothing well actually that was an adapter for my smart charger which is right there I got a UTG Exxon flashlight and I'm going to do a separate review on this but it's actually the flashlight in general works but the uh, the pressure switch doesn't like that you put on vertical grip that doesn't work but and also I got something that I get anyway a black black flash hider right there oh yeah anyway let's Crack open the gun here, as you can see. Standard cardboard box. Very nice. Plasticky, not plastic foam. And the gun. Yeah, it comes with a mag. And I got this from Airsoft Atlanta, because well, I'm in Atlanta. So it comes with a mag. Sorry, this video is a little bit shaky. It comes with a trickle charger, but. You know, I have my smart charger, so I don't even get that out. 1500 milliamp, 9.4, which is good. Uh, this is like a vertical grip. I think it's like King Arms. I think someone told me it was King Arms. And a jamming rod. Whatever. Don't use that really. Never have to. Then the gun. Can't really see it that well, but there are Troy trademarks all over this thing. Really nice rails, but anyway, crane stock. So that was that was just basically an unboxing. I'm gonna do a separate review of it in just a little bit. So stay tuned. All right. 